Hey, 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 it's me, me, Bagman for your Pirate Party candidate for governor in Utah. And today I want to talk about uh, my method for keeping my mustache as pencil thin and beautiful as I can. And you can see it's actually grown quite long. This is about six months worth of growth. And uh, so this technique is um, a technique that I that I read about um, or I watched a video of this. Some guy was talking about having a uh, handlebar mustache and how to do it. And it's it's very, very good. Uh, he recommended using um, hairspray with like a little cardboard cutout thing to basically make sure that your the rest of your face doesn't get hit by hairspray. But uh, I call me old fashioned, but I'm going to uh, have to respectfully disagree. Um, my technique uh, is involving a product called Woody's Beard Balm. This stuff is Amazing. I've used a number of products that have to do with met with uh, maintaining, you know, like like mustache stuff, and this is my favorite by far, by far. Woody's beard balm. It's got a little surfer dude up there. Um, not sure if you can get a good Woody's beard balm for men. It's really really nice. Uh, it comes in a. It looks like white, but it's uh, but it goes on clear. And so you put a little bit on your finger. I mean, it really doesn't take much. Just probably about that much. You rub your fingers in, and then you apply it to the section of the mustache that you want. If you want to curl your mustache up, you grab from, like, with both fingers. You know, you got this stuff on both fingers. You'll grab from this, and you'll twist out. Twist out, and your mustache will curve itself up. And the... Uh, other technique is if you want to curl it down, which who would want to do that? But you could, you would just go the opposite direction, which is you would grab it and curl it inwards if you want to make it go down. And this stuff is amazing. It costs about $20 a jar. At least that's what I purchased it for at a, uh, at a beauty shop, or it was really the, the, the barber shop that I went to. Um, amazing stuff. Great. Another product that works good, but... I'm a little bit less of a fan of it. It's considerably cheaper. This is about $4, $4 a, a tube. This stuff is called Clubman Mustache Wax. You can find this at beauty supply shops. And let me see if I can get a good, I'm not sure I'm gonna be able to get a good thing, but Clubman Mustache Wax. Uh, something I didn't know when I, when I purchased this is that, is that it does have colors in it. So this is the brown. And so when I, when I comb it in, it actually makes my mustache brown. And it looks a little weird because my hair is not naturally brown, even though I know this is not the, uh, the best lit uh, uh, video, but I don't really care. The other thing about this Clubman mustache wax, it's, a, it, it's effective, it does the trick, um, but it tends to clump a lot more than um, the Woody's beard balm. Uh, it, like, like it, if I was to put it in like right here and brush it in, uh, you would see visible streaks where like hair sticks together. Uh, so it, it's, it's really good for this stuff that's out here. But if you're trying to get the inside section done, like underneath the nostrils, uh, it, it's going to be really obvious you're using uh, uh, something because your hair is going to clump together. Uh, so from, if you can afford it, for twenty dollars, you can get the Woody's beard balm. I've had this for a couple of months now. It's only about halfway done. Or you can use the Clubman's mustache wax. This was recommended to me by uh, a guy who had a, an amazing mustache that went clear out to here. I mean, straight, thin out, and it does do that. It does do that. But you have to understand, it does make your hair clump together. So you're not going to use it in places that have a light amount of hair or hairs that aren't super long. This has been Meatbag with Merca Pirate Party candidate for governor in Utah. I hope you found this video informative. If you didn't hit the uh, the down thumbs button, the thumbs down button, because I could really use some extra extra hate. Thank you.